Hi, I'm Omar Palmer for Sheen Magazine. We're here today with a legendary artist, living artist, uh, Mr. Leroy Campbell. He's having an exhibition here in Harlem, New York at the Soul Studio. And we just wanted to stop by and see what's going on. How are you doing? Sir? Doing wonderfully well. Thank Excellent. you for coming through. Oh, thank you for having us. <laughs> you know, New York is my second home. I, I was raised here as an adult and um, uh, seriously was beginning to pursue my career as an artist here. Mm -hmm. So this has been, you know, where the life of the creativity blossomed. I started in 84. Um, there's many layers to my background. <laughs> just, <laughs> like, just like my work, okay. you know. Um, I grew up in Charleston. Okay. Uh, graduate high school in 75. Okay. I moved to New York in 77. And didn't start a painting until 84. I used gel stones and I fused, used newspaper articles and sometimes jewelry and more recently tangible um, elements like real saxophones, real wow. shoes and you know various things that um, but they're all nostalgic stuff because I'm an old soul. The body of work that I've done over the 10 years I've always focused on community culture, history and the, uh, my African-American history as well as my personal history and culture. The work is fused with art and history. You see a lot of newspaper, a lot of collaging in the work and so there's this research in terms of making the newspaper along with the concept cohesive. So there's either research, a lot of digging and going out to look for articles or going online or whatever, or going shopping in various antique places just to find the, the actual right uh, articles or element to help create the work. This is actually my family. This is called Cornbread, one of my earlier pieces. This is my this is my grandmother, that's my mother, that's my grandfather in Mott's Corner, South Carolina. And this is a quilt that was given to me by some quilters in New York years ago. And I think people should go to my website, Leroy Campbell Originals with an S dot com, to be updated. I just want to thank you so, so much for keep believing in me and encouraging me and enjoy your artwork. And, you know, I'm always here for you, just like you're here for me. Well, Mr. Campbell, thank you again for having Shoe Magazine. I wish you the best of luck. Thank you.